Hello students. In the last lecture we see the example number 16 and 17 of the exercise 5.4. Now we continue. Now we see the example number 18. If A 4 comma 3 B which is 0 comma 0 C it is a 2 comma 3 R the voltage is R the voltage is of triangle A B C then find the equation of bisector of bisector of an angle B A C okay now here we find the equation of angle bisector angle bisector it is a straight line okay therefore we find the equation of angle bisector of triangle A B C of the angle A okay now here <coughs> It is A, B, C. A, it is a 4, 3. B, it is a 0, 0. It is the origin. And C, 2, 3. Now, we find the equation of line which bisect the angle A. Okay. Then, it is A and we say here D. That is, AD is an angle bisector. That means, these two angles are the same. Okay. Now, we find the equation of AD. AD is a straight line. So, we find the equation of line by using any one equation of the method of the line finding the equation. Okay. It is a point slope form, equation of line passing through two point or any intercept form here. <coughs> we want to find the equation of line then. Two things are necessary that is the slope of line and passing through point here. The passing through point is given. That is line AD passing through point A. It is a passing through point given. Now we find the slope of line or the coordinates of point D. If we know the coordinates of point D, then by equation of line passing through two points, we know the equation of AD. Okay. Now here given in triangle ABC point A, it is a four comma three point B. It is a 0 comma 0 and point C it is 2 comma 3. Let AD is bisector of angle BAC. AD is a bisector of angle BAC. Now here <coughs> we see the angle bisector theorem. Okay. We can already learn this angle bisector theorem in the class 10 or it is 9, it is a chapter similarity. Okay, here it is A, B, and C. Then AD is an angle bisector. Okay, AD is an angle bisector. Then the triangle ABD similar to triangle ACD. Here triangle ABD and triangle ACD are the similar triangle, not equal. These are the similar triangle. Therefore, the sides are the proportional. That is AB upon AC is equal to BD upon CD. It is BD upon CD. Okay. Here it is a length BD and CD. AB upon AC, BD upon CD and it is AD is a common side. Therefore, the sides are the proportional. If it is here, the triangles are the similar. And we know that by the angle bisector theorem, these two triangles are the similar triangle then we can write this now in this we want to find the coordinates of the point d okay 
we have to find the equation of line AD. Point A is a given. Just we know the point D, coordinates of point D. Then by using the equation of line passing through two points, we find the equation of angle bisector. But here, first we find the coordinates of D. Here, D point on the line BC. That means D point divide BC internally. Here, here D divides BC okay, internally. in the ratio it is BD is to CD or D okay these are the lengths okay that is we know that BD is to CD means AB is to AC okay here that means point D divide BC internally in the ratio AB is to C AC AB is to AC. Now, first we find the ratio of AB and AC. So, we find the distance AB, that is the length of AB and length of AC, then the ratio of the distance. Okay. Now, first length AB is equal to under root of AB, it is AB, 0 minus 4 whole square plus 0 minus 3 whole square, and it is under root of 16 plus. 9 okay it is under root of 16 plus 9 and it is 5 now length ac it is under root of ac a and c it is 2 minus 4 whole square plus 3 minus 3 and that is under root of it is minus 2 square it is 4 plus 0 and it is 2 okay here the point d Point D divide BC internally in the ratio BD is to CD that is AC is AB is to AC and that is 5 is to 2. That means point D divide BC internally in the ratio 5 is to 2. Again by internal division. Okay. Here when the internal division it is point it is here B and C0. B it is x1 comma y1 and C it is x2 comma y2. Then D divides BC internally in the ratio m is to n. Then the coordinates of point D here m into x2 plus n into x1 upon m plus n and m into y2 plus n into y1 upon m plus n. <coughs> okay, here. This, this is a section formula. You are already learning the class 10. Okay, here. It is a section formula. That is d divide bc in the ratio m is to n. d divide bc in the ratio 5 is to 2. Therefore, the coordinates of d coordinates of D. It is B, C. B and it is C. It is X1, Y1 and it is X2, Y2. Therefore, it is a ratio 5 into 2 plus 2 into 0 upon 5 plus 2. It is M into X2 and N into X1. Now, M into Y2 plus N into Y1. 5 into 3 plus 2 into 0 upon 5 plus 2 and then coordinates of point D are here it is 10 upon 7 and here it is 15 upon 7 are the coordinates of point D by using the section formula and the condition it is a similarity of two triangles angle bisector theorem okay here angle bisector theorem these two triangles are the similar therefore it is a ratio then we find the ratio that is D point divide BC in the ratio BD is to DC but it is BD DC is equal to AB AC okay and then AB is to AC it is 5 is to 2 by section formula we can find the coordinates of point D and now we know the point D and A 
and then the equation of line passing through two points by using the equation of line passing through two points it is x minus x1 upon x2 minus x1 is equal to y minus y1 upon y2 minus y1 okay now here this concept are see carefully it is a similarity and it is a section formula where we use this now now the angle bisector ed passing through points e it is 4 comma 3 and d it is 10 by 7 comma 15 by 7 okay now we want to find the equation of line ed therefore equation of ed is ed is an angle bisector now ed passing through two points it is x1 y1 and it is x2 y2 now equation x minus x1 upon x2 minus x1 is equal to y minus y1 y minus y1 upon y2 minus y1 okay now calculate then it is x minus 4 upon here it is 28 minus 10 minus 28 is minus 18 upon 7 is equal to y minus 3 it is 21 that is minus 6 upon 7 it is 7 7 get cancelled okay see carefully that means here therefore x minus 4 upon see carefully 7 7 get cancelled minus 6 and it is minus 18 therefore here it is a 3 and it is y minus 3 okay this 4 7 7 and minus 6 and it is 18 it is 3 and therefore x minus 4 is equal to 3 y minus 9 and then x minus 3y and 9 here plus it is a 5 is equal to 0 it is the equation of angle bisector of the triangle and which angle bisect it is the angle a that is b a c okay see carefully this here this carefully here we use the section formula and internal division by using the concept of the similarity now the next example Next example number 20. O 0 comma 0. A 6 comma 0. And B 0 comma 8. Are vertices of a triangle. of a triangle find the coordinates 
find the coordinates of the in center of triangle OEB okay now here we want to find the coordinate of the in center of the triangle what is meant by the in center in center it is a point of intersection of <coughs> the angle bisectors of the triangle here in triangle there are three angles therefore angle bisectors are the three lines that is the point of concurrence okay here now <coughs> the three angle bisector intersect at a point it is called the in center of the triangle now we want to find the in center of the triangle therefore we want to find the point of intersection of the angle bisectors okay in the previous example we see the equation of angle bisector there is only one angle bisector we want to fi we find okay now here we want to find the any two angle bisectors of the triangle and any two angle bisector of triangle then these equations and then we find the point of intersection of that angle bisector and it is the in center of triangle what is meant by the in center in center it is a point of intersection of angle bisectors of the triangle okay now we find the angle bisector okay last example madhe ekach angle bisector kadli tar idha kontyahi don angle bisector cha equation kada ani there is a point of intersection okay now here <coughs> now here we observe the vertices of the triangle it is o it is origin it is a6 comma 0 that is the point on the x axis and it is b it is a 0 comma 8 that is the point on the y axis okay now here <coughs> we can that is the triangle is a right angle triangle at origin okay. it is origin 0 comma 0 okay now it is a point a 6 comma 0 it is b 0 comma 8 that means this distance it is 8 and this distance it is a 6 because it is a origin now we take any two angle bisector of the triangle any two angle bisector okay here we first a o b angle bisector okay it is angle bisector therefore it is this we can write this type a d sorry sorry it is o d o d is the angle bisector of triangle of the angle o okay now another angle bisector we can take this or this okay any one okay it is an angle bisector okay take any one angle now this point of intersection okay we say it is a e okay this point of intersection it is a in center of the triangle okay now in the last example we see the all concept of the angle bisector theorem section formula here we solve it okay now by last theorem yes sorry it is last example we see the equation of angle bisector now here it is angle bisector od is angle bisector that is d divide d divide ab in the ratio oa is to ab okay d divide ab in the ratio oa is to ab okay now here in triangle o e b o it is a 0 comma 0 a it is a 6 comma 0 and b it is 0 comma 8 okay now let o e and b sorry it is o d o d and b e are the angle bisectors okay angle bisectors now first <coughs> we find the angle bisector equation of angle bisector od okay now here length oa is equal to 6 ob is equal to 8 and now we find the length ab by distance formula it is under root of ab 0 minus 6 whole square plus 8 minus 0 whole square and it is under root of 
it is 36 64 36 plus 64 and it is 10 now we find the lengths of all sides of the triangle now we take first angle by sector now here now point D here D divides EB internally in the ratio here take the ratio ED is to BD or DB that is OA is to OB that is OA it is a 6 is to 8 okay and 6 is to 8 that means 3 is to 4 that is it is 3 is to 4 that means point D divide AB internally in the ratio 3 is to 4 therefore coordinates of D AB it is AB x1 y1 and it is x2 y2 and it is mn okay 3 is to 4 we can take 6 is to 8 but calculation is a lengthy so we can here 3 is to 4 it is the ratio 3 is to 4 it is m and n by section formula it is x1 y1 and it is x2 y2 by section formula here m into x2 plus n into x1 that is the 6 and upon 3 plus 4 again m into y2 here y2 it is 8 and plus n into y1 that is a 0 and upon 3 plus 4 okay and therefore coordinates of d it is 24 upon 7 24 upon 7 and it is again 24 upon 7 okay here coordinates of point d are 24 upon 7 it is again 24 24 upon 7 now it is a coordinate of the that means equation of ad therefore equation of sorry od equation of angle bisector od is okay od passing through which passing through Zero comma zero and twenty four by seven comma twenty four by seven that is line passing through origin. Therefore, it is x one y one and x two y two. X minus x one upon x two twenty four by seven minus x one is equal to y minus y one again y one zero and it is twenty four by seven minus zero. And that is it is x upon 24 by 7 and y upon 24 by 7 therefore equation of line it is x minus y that is x equal to y that is x minus y is equal to 0 it is equation number 1 it is an equation of one angle bisector that is the OD okay now it is It is a D divides EB. Now here BE is an angle bisector that means E divide OA in the ratio it is OB is to AB that means E divides OA in the ratio Here OB is to AB and that is OB is to OB it is 8 is to 10 and that is 4 is to 5 that means E divides OA 
internally in the ratio 4 is to 5. Again by section formula coordinates of E. Therefore E it is ratio M1 and OA points OA it is x1 y1 and it is x2 y2. Then it is M into x2 x2 it is a 6 plus N into x1 upon 4 plus 5. Then M into y2 y2 that means 0 plus again it is 0 upon 4 plus 5 see carefully okay here it is x1 y1 and it is x2 y2 and therefore coordinates of e are it is 24 upon 9 comma 0 okay therefore equation of BE which through B it is 0 comma 8 and 24 by 9 comma 0 passing through two points then equation of line it is x minus x1 upon x2 minus x1 is equal to y minus y1 upon y2 minus y1 and that is it is x upon 24 by 9 is equal to y minus 8 upon minus 8 okay and then the calculation here okay carefully see carefully it is x is equal to 9 upon 24 here sorry here 24 upon 9 multiply 24 upon 9 into y minus 8 upon minus 8 okay and therefore x is equal to see carefully here it is minus 3 okay minus 3 it is minus 1 by 3 x is equal to minus 1 by 3 y minus 8 and therefore 3x minus y sorry 3x is equal to minus y plus 8 that is 3x plus y is equal to 8. It is equation number 2. Okay, see carefully. It is the equation of second that is the angle bisector BE. 3x plus y is equal to 8. Now, we find the in center that means point of intersection of angle bisector. Now, adding 1 and 2. Equation number 1 plus 2. This gives, we get. Equation number 1 and 2 here. x 3x it is 4x then y y get cancelled and 0 plus it is 8 and therefore x is equal to 2 and when x is equal to 2 therefore y is also 2 and therefore in center of triangle O A B is 2 comma 2 okay see carefully in center of triangle it is a 2 comma 2 Okay, see carefully the example <coughs> here we want to find the in center in center is the point of intersection of angle bisectors okay so first we find the equation of angle bisector OE equation of angle bisector OD okay it is a OD x minus y equal to 0 it is equation number 1 then we find the angle equation of angle bisector BE okay BE okay therefore here for the equation of BE we consider the triangle O B O E and B A E. Okay. Then these two triangles are the similar. So <coughs> we get the E divided O A internally in the ratio 5 is to sorry 4 is to 5. Then by section formula we find the coordinates of point E. When we know the coordinates of point E, then we find the equation of B E passing through two points. And then it is the equation of B. Then equation 1 and 2 lines represent the angle bisectors and we know that the point of intersection of angle bisectors it is a in center by solving these two equation we get the values of x and y that is the point of intersection and point of intersection means in center of triangle and it is 2 comma 2 okay see carefully